Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Rad Tarot, and this is going to be Cancer Sun, Cancer Moon and Cancer Rising monthly tarot reading for October 2018 <clears throat> and uh, while I'm shuffling the cards I want to remind you guys that this is a general reading for Cancer Star Sign this is not your personal reading therefore I will explain you the meanings of the cards and uh, their synergy in the representative positions but it falls to you to uh, make sense of them and to align them to your personal situations throughout the month <clears throat> if you want me to do that for you well that is a subject of a personal reading and for personal readings please check out my website which is listed down below in the description of this video and there you are going to find a full list of my services as well as their pricings <clears throat> and one more thing if you find these reports helpful and you want to know even more, there is a extensive tarot reading for this month uh, which, in which we are focusing entirely on career and personal life and that reading also can be purchased from the website and it costs only $1.49. So uh, that being said, going to the spread, this is going to be a five card spread and the first card here will rep represent the topic or the uh, <clears throat> yeah the topic the subject of the month the second card it is a about the best course of action you know the things we need to attend to or you cancers need to attend to the third card is about the challenges that you are going to face throughout the month the fourth card is about the resources that you can rely on throughout the month and the last one that will be the final outcome here or what will be the next thing that will happen after the month passes so let's see what you got here now this is going to be the king of swords so the month is going to be about striking the deals of the century and uh, as well you know taking capitalizing on a, a certain information and that as a matter of fact this card also sits for the how you enter into the month so this is how you're going to do so how you're going to enter having the king of swords you are going to be the king of swords and the king of swords is someone who can very well capitalize on even in the minor uh, advantages that the king has over people over situations and in general over life very important as well is when uh, when when the month hit is that you will become aware of a certain situations that have been quite vague for you uh, over your relationship you know over your career as well and uh, how can I put it into words here let's say that you will be the first one to know and that will give you an extraordinary leverage over others and over the situations and therefore you will have the um, the privilege was the word I was searching for to make a decision first and to kind of capitalize on that information so this month for you uh, cancers will be entirely on info uh, entirely about information and how you um, how you capitalize on it uh, so but the first thing that comes to my mind that could be you know let's say that you're going through a divorce and an information about the divorce can, could come to your knowledge you know just to give an example for that you may become aware that your partner have cheated on you with someone else you know and that was unknown until this very moment which is going to give you an edge into the divorce case that could happen in every single field of your life it doesn't have to be a divorce as well you know but what you need to know is that a you will have as soon as the month start you will come to an information that will give you a leverage over certain people and I said about the divorce because I have a good friend cancer who is going through something like this etc etc so the next card here will be about how you should capitalize with uh, with all that you do have here you know what is the best course of action and this is the four of wands four of wands is the card that says that you need to aim to kind of close a, a cycle of development so if it is about the divorce case then with this information you need to aim to kind of finish that divorce case because now we are seeing that this is going to be a, a gold mine here that you will have and uh, 
you can you can really I don't want to use that strong word but you can really annihilate your competition with it very important with the four of wands is also that you kind of like leave nothing unattended nor even a, a minor detail in your undertakings unattended I this card is also about planning your next steps so you need to start even though that undertaking that you are pushing here with the king of swords is not yet finalized it will be important for you to kind of like uh, start planning for what happens next after you finalize it the four of the four of wands is a, a very positive card in a sense of you know kind of creating a milestone or going for a certain milestone in your development and this is exactly what you need to do because for what it seems here with the king of swords at the end you you finally have the means to do it so and so go for it so uh, let me give you an example here if um if we're talking about personal life or relationships you know let's say that you are single and information comes to you that someone likes you you know and you need to aim to kind of like uh, close that cycle of development reach that milestone either you should make it or break it that is entirely your choice you know but you should not leave the situation hanging in the air because most likely something bigger it is it, it follows up after as soon as you kind of reach that um, and reach a, a competition into that cycle of um, of development and the next card is showing the challenges that you have to overcome throughout the month here this is going to be the full card so this card speaks for a little bit of annoyment and aggravation that you still have to take um, that you still have to you know take that undertaking even in the month of October the full card here points that <clears throat> whatever you're you will have to kind of like reach a completion of it's setting on how every single undertaking in your life and that is uh, that is what the full card is pointing here that a, a new direction until you know until you reach that milestone is kind of not exactly impossible but let's say it's going to be less productive than it can be the full card also points that it's going to be very difficult for you to believe into strangers I don't know why I said that but uh, it, it just suddenly came to me but yeah the fool has a, a fate into complete strangers and uh, <clears throat> because the, the fool is, uh, is pure and innocent and therefore for what it seems this particular month it will be a difficult for you to make new friends right but that doesn't mean that you cannot uh, you know this is a, a challenge and a challenge can be overcome and when we talk about the fool here as a challenge it will be also challenging for you to kind of like have fun as well because the fool is one of the cards which has fun with with its uh light heart um <clears throat> The detachment as well you know unaffectedness for the world but you will be quite affected here with that new information coming in your way and therefore uh, you will have you know a, a very difficult time to have fun and un until you kind of reach a certain milestone <clears throat> so this month for you cancers will be entirely about a, a finalizing a event carrying on for me quite a while which was in a in many ways despondent for your life and for your situation the full card here also asks you not to take any chances and not to take any leap of fates all right don't take any risks because you don't have to all right you do have all the security here that you need and you should not play with uh, with the circumstances so the resources that you can rely on here that is the two of pentacles the information that you are going to um uncover and that will come to your way will create a, a lot of changes into your environment in and in general in the field that this information comes to so the resources that you can rely on is the new adaptation of the plan this card points that you can make the new environment you know of that field the way you like to make it also not to mention that with the two of pentacles this is a, a card of a abundance of varieties all right it is not abundance of resources but abundance of varieties and the varieties are uh, themselves are uh, a resource 
So what this card asks you here as a resources to be utilized is the opportunity, not exactly the opportunities, but the versatilities of how you can approach a certain situation. Every single one of them has to be taken under consideration. So this card points that plans uh, for the current undertaking are, uh, are rather unadvisable. Of course, you can plan for what happens next, but for this current one, uh, they should not be created plans, you know, because um, if you are playful and if you are capable to juggle with, um, with every versatility that this information here present itself to you then for what it seems you will always catch your rivals uh, unprepared you know and you will always will be able to corner them so what we're talking about with these cards is that you are you will end up a, a victorious into a certain battle that you are leading as i said over custody for example divorce colleague into your career um a third party into your relationship etc etc but you have to take that thing very very serious as we do have the full car into a challenging position and even if that information it kind of could jeopardize the future of your rival well that should not be your concern at least according to the tarot cards because the king of swords does not concern how his actions are going to affect those who oppose him and the last card, it will be the final outcome. What happens after this period of intensity? It's not turmoil, but it is intensity. It's, uh, it's over. And uh, the temperance here points that things are going to calm down in a very severe way. The temperance is a card pointing that you will finally kind of end uh, um, exit a era of a extreme measures extreme actions and you are going to find a, a a balanced path to move on forward either into your career and either into your relationship undertakings which until this very point after that milestone is reached were seemingly annoying uh, aggravating you know uh, and less interesting now will be taken with much more enthusiasm and, and, and with much more vigor to be accomplished realizing that they has to be attended otherwise uh, uh, the whole situation will be placed on halt and there is no move on forward the temperance points that at the end you are going to find a lot of uh, compassion and a lot of solidar solidarity from people who did not support you throughout the process but they will finally see that you had your point of view you you had your standpoint as well and that standpoint was correct and they will learn how to how to honor it so at the end for what it seems what my my true uh, thoughts on this reading, Cancer, is that here you are standing alone against the world, all right, in a certain uh, field of your life. And despite that you were alone against the world, you finally prevailed because you are capable, you know, to utilize the certain information which is which work uh, which came to your way, and at the end. Um, you know, people sow your righteousness and they acknowledged it and they will honor it. So that being said, Cancer, uh, this was your monthly tarot reading of October 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And uh, again, this is a, a general reading for Cancer star sign, guys. This is not your personal reading. And uh, therefore, I have explained you the meanings of the card and their synergy in the spread but it forced you to make sense of them and to align them to your personal situation if you want me to do that for you well this is a subject of a personal reading and for personal readings please check out my website which is listed down below in the description of this video and there you're going to find a full list of my services as well as their pricings and don't forget that if you find these reports helpful you can also contribute uh, for the extensive monthly tarot reading uh, which we are focusing uh, strictly upon career and relationship life and that extended tarot reading can be purchased again from my website for just dollar forty nine. So <clears throat> Rat signing out now. See you next time. Bye.